Hi everyone and welcome to NameHero.com. Today I'm going to demonstrate on how to set up Cloudflare on your domain with Railgun support. Now this is an absolutely free feature with all of our basic web hosting accounts. So if you have a basic hosting account with us and you already have Cloudflare, Cloudflare installed, so you just have to enable it. So right now I'm in our, our platform and I'm under the domain name that I'm about to enable. And this is, has our uh, blogger package for the basic cloud hosting. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and log into cPanel by clicking there. Okay, now I'm inside of cPanel, so I'm just going to scroll down here to Cloudflare and click here. Um, once I do that, we're going to see all our, our Cloudflare interface. So what I need to do now is just simply enter my email address for this website. So we're just going to call it um, admin at namehero.org. And if you have not already, please read through their terms of service to make sure that you do not... Um, um, that you're in compliance with those. This Cloudflare is a third party. We we are just affiliated with them through that partnership. So they have a different set of terms of service than we have at Name Hero. So please make sure you click theirs and read through them. But um, as soon as you do that, you can agree to them and then you click sign up now. And this go ahead and create your own Cloudflare account. So they're going to email you separately a password for that account. You can manage everything in our interface, but there's some features that you'll need to go to their site to handle. Okay, so you can see now we, we're all set up, so the only thing we need to do to enable it is click. And as you can see, as soon as we click, it just takes a second, and then the cloud turns orange, meaning that you have been activated. So then you can click Manage here, and you can see your different um, records for your DNS. And again, you manage these back inside of cPanel, but it just shows that you can actually tell it which records to run on Cloudflare, but I suggest just leaving this default here, and then you'll be all set. Um, there's some other options here that you can check out. You can click on Status. Now this shows Cloudflare's system status overall, so you can kind of scroll down. Down and you can see if there's an issue with any of their servers. You can see there's one currently in Africa and they've got it rerouted. So um, you can keep up with that. Um, there's the security settings on your site here. So you can click on the settings button. And since this is a free Cloudflare account, um, it everything comes included. But if you want to upgrade to their pro, you can do that, but you would need to go through Cloudflare's website to do that. Um, but anyways, if you, um, you want to turn up the security settings, you can go to high. If you were to get a DDoS attack, you can go, I'm under attack, and then it's going to um, put a browser integrity screen um, that makes sure it's a real visitor. Um, but you shouldn't have to worry about any of these settings unless you are receiving a DDoS attack. And if that's happening, you will be working with our support team the whole way to get you through that. Okay, now on the um, performance tab here, we can take a look at that. Okay, you can scroll down here and you can notice that um, this is, again, the free Cloudflare account. Um, if you're developing your website, meaning if you're, if you're working on it, working on your style sheets and stuff, you want to click Enable here because that's going to disable the caching. Um, with the caching, sometimes you don't always get a fresh screen. That's what keeps the site loading so fast. So if, if you're developing, you definitely want to click that. Now, if you just want to clear your cache, you can do it right here by clicking Purge. Um, always online. This just makes your site always show it online. Um, let's just say that there would be a server outage for whatever reason, which is highly unlikely, but if so, then Cloudflare is going to pull your site from a cache so the visitor at least sees the cache version of the page. You can leave IPv6 off, and then you can set your caching level to aggressive or basic. It, by default, it's aggressive, meaning that all the files that we can cache through Cloudflare are cached. Um, if you want to go down to basic and not cache as many as the JavaScript files and stuff, then you can do that here, but I suggest just leaving that default. Click on analytics and get some analytics. Now since we just enabled this there's not a lot of stuff but as time goes on you'll start to see your page views and uniques and all that stuff. Um, you can click support here and you can see Cloudflare has all their documents then of course you have our support team. So you kind of have two areas of support for the Cloudflare on your domain. So that's it. Um, it also comes 100% free with their Railgun. Now for the Railgun to get enabled you'll just need to contact our support team after you've enabled your zone and just say hey you guys I just want to make sure that Railgun's enabled and then we'll make sure that that is completed. So besides that you're ready to go. Cloudflare allows your website to load a lot faster so if you expect a lot of traffic or you just want to make sure your site's loading really quick we highly suggest turning that on. Once again it's completely free of charge along with your um, package here at namehero.com. So thanks a bunch everyone and enjoy the fast speeds of the cloud.